guys, it's Alana and welcome back to my channel for another video. Now today I'm bringing you another collection video and I'll be sharing with you my show jacket collection. Now I did not realise I had this many. This is a product of me literally not growing and not changing in shape. I still have the same shape as a 10 year old girl. Um, so I've ended up just collecting my jackets over the years because I've never had to get rid of any because I've never outgrown any. Um, so I've ended up with quite the amount. I'm going to share them with you today because I literally love every single one of them and I want to share that love with you. <laughs> um, so yeah, I've got about 17 jackets here. So let's start getting into it. <laughs> Now we're going to get started in with the first one. I think you guys are going to start thinking I have quite the addictive personality and I would be inclined to agree. <laughs> so we're going to go in with a, oh gosh, it's falling over. We're going in with a bang with, you know, yield faithful flying changes. I don't know which one this is because I haven't unzipped it yet. Oh yes, so this is actually my newest edition. I haven't had the chance to compete in this yet, but this is my new brown short tails from Flying Changes. Literally just got this for Christmas and it is stunning. Okay, so this is what she looks like on. I've got her with my Velcro stock. We, we have things ready tied. I don't think I could actually tie a stock. And Ella being called Golden Girl. I love having her out in gold um and brown and so i ended up with this it was a complete surprise i had absolutely no idea it was coming and look it's even got the paisley pattern there and the gold thread going down the back like okay okay we see you so this is my brown tail coat and this is my favorite jacket oh i don't know well it's certainly one of the favorites because i mean look at that even the lining and when you ride it like flaps and you see all the gold and oh it's so nice so this in contrast to my short tails jacket has the diamonds the crystals for the buttons but i feel that like totally works in a separate way to the way it does on the short coat because this jacket is extra it gives extra little <laughs> I love it. It is. It gives extra, okay? And so having the diamonds, and I see you there. I see them. Do you see them? Uh, having that just absolutely adds to it. You feel like absolute boss when you come in here wearing this. Okay, so we've got another Flying Changes one, um, and this one is Ye Old Faithful, okay? she has seen so much she's been through the wars she has done everything <clears throat> this jacket is a hard favorite so she th i wore this with my royal blue boots my electric blue boots I i've just never felt better do you know what i mean oh i'm gonna want to stock on with it though oh my gosh i'm not gonna give you a close-up of the stock it is foul it is foul this stock well not the stuff but like it's just so dirty oh. but yes and also that's how easy it is to put the stocks in you just well you get your mum to tie it and then you pop it on your neck 12 out of 10 it's not straight though so oh well mm -mm -mm. Away. boom hello like excuse me but this is so lush and look the blue just pokes out here and this was specifically gotten so that it would match my royal blue boots um yeah this was this is also another like christmas present <laughs> and this was specifically bought to match my royal blue boots so with its royal blue accents because it's giving like amazing whilst also still giving classical if you get what i mean if you're catching my vibe Okay, this is actually my last Flying Changes one, so you do not have to worry, this video is not an ad for Flying Changes. Although Flying Changes, just in case you're watching. Love you, you're my fave. <laughs> um, anyway, <laughs> moving swiftly on. Basically, Ella's colour, it's changed now, but Ella's colour was purple. Yeah, I'm going to wear this one. So... We were like, right, I want to compete her in purple. Because, like, I feel like for Ella, her colours are gold because of her name, Golden Girl. Um, and then she's also purple because all of, like, my, my grooming stuff, all of my um, yard tools, they're all purple. She's now been changed to red, though. <laughs> oh, well. Um, 
so we got this and how cute and then so i got this stock to go with the hat that i have to go with the jacket which might be in a separate video we'll see how many ideas i come up for with videos um and then this was the stock that was originally to go with it and i think it's super pretty okay so the next one coming up is not flying changing tailor not flying changes one this is a sham huge this was my very first set of tails ever wow you know when you feel really elegant this jacket never fails to make me feel so elegant i just feel i feel like i feel like an english gentleman in this one do you know what i mean i feel like i could swan into a room do you see me swanning i'm swanning i love it i look the, the look at the little tip hold on i want you to see the points how pretty is that it's so lovely such a nice little detail and then we've also got it there right there and this jacket is actually one that you see quite a lot at shows if you go to any show where they're doing tailcoats you will see like at least two of these jackets like my best friend has the exact same jacket as me uh, it's the exact same tailcoat it's mad and i love it i absolutely love it okay so this jacket this is just my go-to when i need a jacket you see my crusty dusty i call that my normal stock so this is that stock goes just with everything really um but for the purpose of today's video a show shirt will do i just recently wore this to compete um for my university um in our very first competition i'll probably be wearing it again um not next week but the week after because we've got another competition coming up so fingers crossed we're going to, we're going heading to Durham so that should be fun as long as I'm not driving because I hate to drive that way um anyway moving on and it is actually really lovely I know it's oh look at the back the back's cute the back has a moment I love these moments um I know it's my backup jacket but I do really love it and I actually I wear it pretty much all the time the smell would suggest so too. <laughs> so this is a remnant of a bygone era. So this was from, I really hope it does up to be honest, because this is from when I was younger and Gilly has grown since then. Basically, I, oh, just chip the nail polish. Well, I thought I was going to be a show jumper. And back when I was show jumping, all the girls that won always had red jackets. So I was convinced I needed a red jacket if I was going to win. So I was like, mum, I need a red jacket. So I got a red jacket. And you know what? I won a fair bit in this red jacket. It was pretty good. <laughs> like, and this makes me want to have my hair in like a show jumper's ponytail and run around and like put on sunglasses or something. I don't know. I just feel like a cool girl in this jacket. Okay, now this jacket has a funny backstory as well. So... <laughs> I was starting out on TikTok, literally, it still has the tag in it, even though I've literally competed in it, I've just not taken the label off. Um, I was just starting off on TikTok and I decided that I needed to do a Harry Potter video and have a jacket for each of the houses. And I had my red jacket for Gryffindor, I had my gold tails for Hufflepuff and I had my navy tails for Ravenclaw, what I didn't have was anything for Slytherin. So I, I put myself onto eBay and was like, right, I need a cheap green jacket for this video. And the, be the what best bit is the video did not even do that well. The video was mid. <laughs> and it literally cost me about £40. And I was like, you know what? I will probably compete in it at some point. That's an investment. It is. It's an absolute serve. Like, I adore the diamonds going around there. Love it. Even the zips have got little diamonds on. How cute is that? And then we've got the crystal buttons, of course. And then in the back, we've got our moments. Okay. And it's lovely. This one was a fun jacket. This one's been and seen and done everything. So I think this was my first bedazzled jacket. Like, Okay, this was the beginning for everybody. The beginning of the end. I'm, so, I'm so, once again impressed it still fits because it's been many years since I've worn this. And look, it, my very first glitzy jacket. Like, so we've got the one crystal there 
and then we'd go to normal ones. She, do you know what? You cannot be a plain black jacket. Goes with absolutely everything. No matter what you turn up to, you will be fine. Okay, I'm just heading straight in, popping this on already. And this jacket was another one that has seen and done everything. So this was another one that was secondhand. And honestly, it's been a fantastic. So this was bought originally to go with the blue boots, just like the Fine Changes one was, um, until we decided that we needed, well, I say we decided, my mum surprised me with um, the navy blue Fine Changes one, because she felt like I needed a posher one, bless her. Loving the electric blue binding, that just used to set off the blue boots so well, and it's like navy blue, it looks black, but it's navy blue. Um, and it was just, it was an absolute moment. Cause like you don't, I don't know. I like, I haven't really seen other jackets like this for a while. And do you know, I feel like I should bring it back. I should bring it back. I like it. And then this was actually another recent uh, present. Um, basically, with the boys being young, I don't want them to just do dressage all the time. I want them to have fun. So there is some debate about me allegedly taking them hunting. I think I'd, I think I'd be all right taking star hunting because I only go out with the um, bloodhounds. And basically they're just, it's fast, but I think the faster it is, the less time it gives your horse to mess about. My mum also pre-tied this stock for me. <laughs> how good's that so this was an ebay find as well um it's nice and roomy which you know you need to be when you're out hunting and it is just absolutely lovely totally classic you cannot go wrong with a tweed jacket oh bless her so this was the very first jacket that i competed ella in oh putting it on so this is an equi theme one i believe Put it on, I love, I, do you know what, soft shell jacket, soft shell jacket, it's just so lush. I love the material, it's so nice. Um, so yeah, like going back to a previous statement that I made, Ella's, uh, Ella's called Golden Girl, so the very first thing I wanted to compete her in was something gold. So we got this jacket and once again an eBay find because we love eBay and it's just so lovely. Um, I recently got the Fine Changes short tails just so I could wear my gold stuff, um, with a tail jacket because I don't, I don't, I love the short tails because it makes me feel like I'm all missing tails. It, it makes me feel more fancy schmancy. Oh no, take it up with my, my mind, it works in strange ways. But this is so lovely. I literally remember riding Ella crying after we got 75%. Do absolutely love the crown love it i just think that it just adds to it because ella's a monarch she's a queen and then the gold details on the zips i love it when they do this with the zips do you know what i mean i think that is an opportunity to have a good time and then we've also got gold gold here i'm trying to show you but failing to get my angles right the gold there's lovely so when you're counting around it flaps and you gold Ooh. okay i'm not gonna cap with you guys this jacket competes for top spot it genuinely does <sighs> just love it look at that just just have a moment take it in look at that look at that i think um so this is a, this is my um, red flare play jacket i love this so you know how i said the red pure jacket that was my show jumper one made me feel like a cool girl well this makes me feel like a bad b okay it is just beautiful, darling. Okay. You literally, you ride around having like, you have your own theme music in the jacket. I love it. Okay. It's lovely. And like I said, with the short tails, it always makes me feel like a proper dressage rider. And like one of my dream tail coats would be to have this but in tails, like, could you imagine how epic that would be? It is just absolutely stunning, beautiful, amazing, a moment. And it looks so good with Ella. 
So I wear this on Ella with my red tam shield and my red boots and it is beautiful, genuinely. With her full blackness and then when she's in peak condition she gets all muscly, she looks like a little ball of muscle. It looks amazing, amazing. Okay, and then we've also got my navy blue procure. Oh my gosh, it has been some years since I have worn this. Um, and this was my ultimate safe coat. So when I was too scared to wear my bright blue boots, uh, with when I was too scared to wear my bright blue flying changes, I would put this on and love it. And of course, I couldn't help myself from getting a bit of bling because it's me. And then we've also got a moments in the back. I love it. This is probably one of my most understated jackets that would still be wearable. I love that. I really just noticed that. But that's so subtle and yet so lovely. I think it really adds to the jacket. And like you just, you feel lovely, you feel classic and you feel elegant in this jacket, which I think is an absolutely amazing feeling to have. So this jacket literally made me laugh when I bought it. So at the time I was riding a Palomino. Um, it was between having, it was before I had Ella. I was riding a Palomino called Solaris. And we were like, do you know what would be really fun? Do you know what would be really fun? If I had a pink jacket. <laughs> we got me a pink jacket and it was amazing it was so funny and you know what every time i wore the pink jacket i got a bloody pink rosette so i still tell you wearing that red jacket made sure i got red rosies wearing a pink one made sure made sure i got pink rosies and when i wore the purple jacket the purple fine change jacket you bet you i got a purple rosie Oof, oh my god guys i thought that pile was never ending but we are on the last jacket and we will end it on a favourite of mine. I love this. So this was the jacket that I accidentally qualified for nationals <laughs> in. So basically I'd taken Katrina to do my quest and um, we were, I was meant, I was doing the novice and then I did the elementary class as well because I was like, you know what, there is no point in me going and doing one class, we'll do the elementary as well, even though literally me and Katrina couldn't even like yield. We we couldn't do elementary. We just did it just so it wasn't a waste of a day, really, um, which weren't traveling all that way for one class. And I missed out on qualifying in the novice, which was the class that I was actually good at, and then got a wild card to go to nationals at elementary. <laughs> so there we go. And this is just so elegant. It is absolutely lovely. I still have the pictures of when I wore it at that outing and I just felt like a queen. I felt elegant. I was like, yes, I am here. Hello. I love it. I love it. I love the little diamond moments that we have here. Love the grey crystal buttons. Like getting the grey crystals in with the grey jacket. Love it. All right, guys. So that is all from me today. I really hope you enjoyed watching this video. Um, going through this video now, I only just realised quite how many show jackets I have. Um, it's a problem. I would say I'm going to work on it, but I'm not going to work on it. I'm quite happy as I am. <laughs> um, yeah. So it's just having this many is just something that's happened where over the years I've not grown and so when normally a person would need to replace it you know going from a kid riding ponies to getting older I haven't needed to and I've I've just ended up with loads of jackets cause I still got the ones from when I was like 10 that I can still just about button up um so it's just one of those things where I've ended up with a lot and I just wanted to share them with you because I absolutely adore every single one of them and I want and I, I was hoping that you guys would too um so yeah that is all from me today I really hope you enjoyed this video if you haven't already don't forget to give it a big thumbs up subscribe to my YouTube channel hit that notification bell so you know when the next video is getting uploaded um if you have any ideas or anything else that you would like to see from me please feel free to comment let me know I will try my best to accommodate you and I could do with the ideas quite frankly um so yeah until next time guys it is goodbye